Hello, I just got home from Pilates and uh, I have to get ready for radio today but today I'm going to be doing something very different and special because we are celebrating Halloween in advance today even though it is only the 28th we don't have radio on Saturday and every Wednesday Iris dresses up as something different and comes into the studio so I thought I would do something to celebrate Halloween for my listeners today I'm gonna be transforming myself into an e-girl this was super last minute I didn't have time to get a costume or anything I actually had this mint colored wig that I got some time ago on YesStyle. I don't know why, I just felt compelled to buy a wig and I guess this is why. So I thought it would be perfect for the e-girl transformation. I actually did my foundation before I went to Pilates just because I felt like I wouldn't have enough time. And sorry if I'm talking too fast right now, it's because I'm kind of in a rush. I only have like 40 minutes to get ready and I don't know if I could do all the makeup in 40 minutes but we'll see okay I got my fake eyelashes ready I think I have everything ready so let's go um, so e-girls I don't know if you guys know but e-girls is something that's been trending on TikTok for a while now I just like their aesthetic it's very um, badass punk gothic but also very anime-ish at the same time and it's their makeup for me I don't know how these so many of these girls are so talented with putting on makeup it's just crazy and also there are many different types of e-girls there's like those really artistic e-girls who are geniuses at makeup and then there are those more um, soft e-girls all right, so I feel like I should start with the eye makeup and for the eye makeup, I'm finally gonna use this palette from Morph. Morphe? Morphe? I don't know how to pronounce it, but look at all these crazy colors that I never got to use before. And I realized that uh, the e-girl makeup tends to be really heavy on the eyes. So I'm going to just be bold and go in with this pink color first. Oh god, I hope I don't mess this up. Oh, and also the really important part of the e-girls aesthetic is the blush. They also put the blush on the nose too to look like you've been suffering from a cold and a runny nose for like a month. Kind of makes you look frail, I guess, but I love it. I've always wanted to try it and today is perfect. I mean, I did an ABG transformation with Joan on her channel and I feel like this is gonna be like a Another one of those transformations. I wish I had Joan to do it with me, but... Usually we celebrate Halloween with our friends, but this year, of course, because of Corona, we can't. The only thing I'll be doing for Halloween this year is getting dressed to go to radio. The lighting in here is pretty bad because the lighting is coming in from the side, but... Okay, and then I guess I'll go in with the darker pink. Help me. Guys, remember that I am not a makeup guru, as you can tell. It's looking. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a darker color at the ends just because I feel like I gotta like blend this out. I wish I was talented in makeup. They look so good. But I'm pretty sure it takes them a long time to do their makeup too And I'm sure it's not easy doing that kind of makeup So props to them okay, My hair is getting annoying Let me go in with the eyeliner I'm just gonna use this liquid eyeliner from Stila The liner has to be thick and long and big That sounds so wrong but... if you guys dressed up as something let me know what to dress up as for the makeup reference i'm using this just kind of winging it as i go i'm not actually on tiktok i tried to follow it for a while but this wasn't my cup of tea so i just deleted it completely off my phone now but these days my mom would be sending me TikTok videos and say try this or like haha this is so funny and I'm like mom you're on TikTok oh my eyeliner is crooked it's not the same damn it 
God damn it. Okay, I'm gonna have to go in with the cheeks now. So I'm gonna use this pink color. This is a little too light though. I feel like I need something that's really pink. Something that pops, something you could see from far, far away. And I'm gonna put some on my nose too. Oh my god, I look like I'm drunk. <laughs> is this the way you do it? <laughs> a lot under my eye I'm gonna layer on the eyeshadow color I used just to make it a little more harmonious and make it match better let me try closeness okay it's like a little more yellow in here but and I'm gonna add freckles 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 and then I'm gonna use this brown mascara that I have but Never mind. Eyebrow pencil. Never mind. This is not working either. Get up. <laughs> this is too dark. Oh shit. the blush over what do i use for freckles just pencil freckles look super fake but okay that'll have to do for now i'm gonna do the highlighter part now highlighter is very important you have to put a lot of highlighter on the tip of your nose make it very shiny and also on your cupid's bow Enough. Your cheekbones too. They look so good. Like, why can't I do this makeup? Like, look how shiny their face looks. How do I do that? How do I achieve this look? I need a little bit more highlighter on my nose bridge. Just highlighting my entire face. It seems like. Oh, I definitely need more makeup. More, more, more! Okay, let me just try putting on some fake lashes. Maybe that'll help. I have these crazy falsies from Huda Beauty. So I'm on a mission or something to get this done in the amount of time I have. Oh god. Whoa. Looks like I have a furry animal on my eye. I don't know why it's not sticking. Maybe I should cut it in half. Maybe it's too long. Okay. All right. These lashes may be a bit too much, but it's okay. These are the only lashes I have anyways. Wow, I never knew how hard it was to put on fake eyelashes. This is really fun though. I'm using this for the first time. It's my new mascara from NARS. This is like the sexiest mascara I've ever, I've ever seen. It kind of also reminds me of the foam rollers too. Wow. Drawing fake eyelashes in. Wow. I'm like contemplating if I should put like black lips or just go with like nude lips. Should I cut it a little bit? Or do you think I'm just gonna that up? But at the same time, it's just like way too long. I cut the eyelashes a little bit. What do we think? It's like a little better. Let me show you from a different lighting. Oh, okay. So from this lighting, it could see the highlights very well. I gotta put on contact lenses. I actually have these contact lenses from Honey Color. I got these contact lenses from Honey Color about a month ago. I was waiting for the right timing to put them on. I was just gonna do them for a regular get ready with me, but I thought today would be perfect because I feel like with e-girls, you need these contact lenses. I got the Perfect Hue collection and they come in five different shades of gray. I'm gonna put this one on called Victoria Gray. So they're the yearly contacts and they are also FDA approved. So this is how I look with the contacts. Whoa, that's bright. 
Okay, and then for this eye, I'm gonna try putting on the color Nordic Grey just to see which one I like better. If you go to their website, they have so many different kinds of contact lenses. Ones for everyday wear and ones for cosplay and Halloween if you want. So I feel like there's something for everyone on the website. It's really affordable too. Okay, so this side is Nordic Grey and this side is Victoria Grey. Which one should I go with? Oh. This one's a bit bigger and they're a little more natural compared to this one. I'm gonna go with the Victoria Grey. Make sure to wash your hands with soap before putting on the contacts and make sure to rinse your contacts with contact solution before putting them on. And I check to make sure that there's nothing on the contact lens or else it's gonna be very painful. Okay, they're in. I'm feeling more like an e-girl now with the contacts on. It's time for me to get changed. I'll see you guys after. Oh my gosh. So, what do you think? Do I look like an e-girl? I put on like all the silver jewelry and chain I could find. I layered my striped turtleneck with this black shirt and then another tank top on top and I would have loved to wear a plaid skirt because I feel like a lot of e-girls wear plaid skirts but I don't have one so I just wore my super baggy jeans I just have to decide on the lip color now everything looks a little more tied together right should I go with the maroon color or a black color or nude color I'll try on this super dark lip looks lighter in the video than in person <gasps> and I was dispigmented I think this is good oh my god I look like I should come out in like an episode of Black Mirror or something no? who is she? I think I'm done I forgot how annoying it is to have long hair. Everything's getting tangled. Just gonna color off. I feel so jittery right now for some reason. I can't wait to see everyone's reaction at radio. How do I pose like an e-girl? Is it like that? I don't know any TikTok songs. I'll also show you guys how the different contacts look with more natural makeup as well. These are called Peony Grey and these are definitely my favorite pair. It looks almost pink-ish in some lighting. It's not very sunny today so I'm using my flash to show you what it would look like if you were to get photographed in the dark. Because the Lux Grey lenses have the dark gray outer rim, it makes the lenses look a lot bigger than the other ones. So if you're into those big circle lenses, then this is for you. These are the long gray ones and these are the most natural looking ones. It has a brown tint in the middle part, so I feel like it'll go well with any kind of makeup look. Thank you for watching this portion of the vlog. I will leave the link for the Perfect Hue collection in the description box. And also there's a discount code for you guys so you guys can get 10% off. Thanks again to Honey Color for sponsoring this video. But for now, it's time for me to head to radio and surprise my listeners! Yay! I look bad when I smile. I should not smile. I should look like I hate the world. I totally forgot about my nose ring, but I put both of them on. I should leave now, for real. Okay, bye. I think about you. I think about you. <laughs> I think about you.